I think it's a really special experience to be part of the Suzuki Cup. This, you know, it's, it's the competition for the best eight teams in South, Southeast Asia. So, you know, the crowds, just just everything about it really is just something to look forward to. And obviously, after the, um, our experiences last time, hopefully we can try and replicate that. And you know, we'll see how we go. So I think you know you're gonna expect you know more TV coverage, you know more interviews, more people coming out to watch. Um, you know, certainly a partisan crowd in, in, in Thailand. Yeah. It, it's it's going to be a very hostile environment. Mas maganda yung naging panalo namin sa Singapore last weekend kasi parang nakuha namin yung game para sa Suzuki Cup. So magandang preparation yung para sa final final stage. The, the, I guess the main difference is the strength and depth. When you look at our team from two years ago. Um, there was probably maybe 14 guys who realistically were going to see the field. Now, the coach has obviously got, you know, 30 guys who we can potentially pick from. So just making the squad is, in itself is going to be um, an, an accomplishment. And then from there, he obviously has a headache as to who we can pick because the squad depth is so high. Our biggest strength is that we are a team. It's, it's as easy as, as it sounds. Strength. Um, I would say that, I don't know if I should say this, because what if they see this and they're going to be like, oh, we're going to counter that. Uh, well, we have a really good team spirit within the group now, you know, because we played so many games together, because we've been away on so many different camps together. You know, we're, we're, we're friends as, as much as anything else, and when it comes down to tournament play, when it comes down to the, you know, the last five minutes of a game where you know that someone's going to put their body on the line for the rest of their teammates, I think we've got that. I think that's going to be our biggest strength. I think we're, we're our own biggest weakness, I guess. I think that there are games where we can really, really take teams and and dominate, um, but at the same time, there are games where we, we're our biggest enemy, you know, and I think that if we just stay focused, um, we have the potential to win the whole thing. So I think we just need to stay focused and remember that, uh, that we have the talent and, and just to, to really just have the confidence to do well. Biggest weaknesses? I don't know. I don't really want to say, just in case the other teams are watching. And I, I think there is a lot of pressure because we, Especially because of the Peace Cup and uh, the last re uh, the, the last results against good good teams. Well, siguro dahil sa daming nag-expect sa akin na magagawa ng magandang result, nakatulong sa team. So, ma ma malaking pressure sa akin na mak makapag-perform sa game. There, there are a lot of uh, there's there's pressure, but I I don't feel it. As professional sportsmen, you kind of thrive off that kind of that pressure. You know, you need to be able to. We need to be able to perform to your best under that. So, you know, for me, that's that. That's not a problem. That that just comes with the job. It's it's more the excitement. You know, I think we've got a really good squad this time. Um, I think we're better prepared. So, yeah, we're in we're in good shape at the moment. So I think that's been probably one, you know, one of the major advantages to our success from two years ago is that um, is, is the awareness and the fact that people really come out now and, and support us so I think that's that's really the best thing when you can go out and know whether it be in Thailand or the Middle East or here at home you know that there's going to be you know Filipinos all over um, coming to support us. Yeah, it's amazing. It's, uh, honestly it's, uh, I always say the sentence it's like a dream come true that I played here you know? when, I was a, when I was a kid I, I always said yeah it's, my, 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 my big goal is to play for the national team. Every single time I put this jersey on, it's, you know, I'm playing for my family, you know, I'm playing for the country, and I leave it out on the field. The feeling you get when the crowd are cheering for you and the national anthem's going, it's, you, you can't describe those kind of feelings, and, you know, the, I'd say they're the, best, they're the best moments you have. I really, really honestly believe that we can go to the finals and, and win this thing. Kaya. Yeah, why not? Uh, the supporters are totally different from from Europe supporters or something like this. You know, they've been amazing um, you know, all, the, all the way through my career since I've been involved. In the last two years, it, it's just blown up to something you know, uh, you know, far, far bigger than we ever could expect. I, I never, I never saw something like this. And it's always positive. It's not like when you when you receive a goal, it's not like they stop stop supporting you. It's like really the the best thing that that could happen to us. I think. It's continue supporting us because you know we we feel every single shout and every single scream and that keeps us going every single minute of every game so we want to thank you guys for that and uh, hopefully bring home the gold for you guys. We appreciate every single message on Twitter, everything on Facebook, um, you know we just, our main aim is just to do as well as we can to, so you guys can be proud of us. Thank you for your support.